I was born with seven ladies and I'm the only son. Now you can imagine I was basically accustomed to seeing women doing their hair all the time. So the interest developed as I saw that, you know, a lot of women, their hair is damaged. And if you look at our product, we say, you know, fix the damage before it occurs. That's always been our mantra. My family, it's from the Pelotona side, they are chiefs. And from the Kumalo side, they are also chiefs. So then I thought, well, I'm going to come up with the name Pure Royal. So it's absolute pure royalty. That's how I came up with the name. It took me a long time before I became a click supplier. I kept knocking at their doors and on the third year, they said to me, look, we like your product because we've had good reviews about your product. It's a wonderful partnership because I think Clix recognizes that the demographics of this country is completely different. You've got almost 55 million black people in this country and you go to supply them. They come to your store on a day-to-day -day basis. If you've got a locally made product, the partnership works very well. And the relationship is so wonderful. I mean, we won the Supplier of the Year Award 2020, which was amazing. I mean, it was the time of COVID, but the kind of service that we gave them was amazing. It's not bureaucratic. They make it easier for you to understand their steps. And if you don't, it's a phone call away. You are able to talk to the buyer at any given time to say, look, how do I do this? How do I fill this form? You know, I don't understand how to do it. And they say, no, no, please talk to X, and then you are able to do it. Because I started in the in Alexander Township, I started doing this in the boot of the car. I created Brand Ambassador. You have to have the buy-in from your consumer before you get into the shelf. Don't just make a product and put it on the shelf. It's not gonna sell. Our product was well known in the salons before it went into any retail shelf. My advice to young people also always is to say, the market is receptive out there. Come up with something that is unique and you can make it. It's not impossible. South Africa is a beautiful country and I really believe that this is our hub, right? So the only way that we can create and ensure that our economy grows is by making sure that we've got more and more entrepreneurs. But how do we do that? I always say, go back to tertiary. Educate them from when they're young to become business individuals. Making products is not about making lots and lots of money. It's about leaving a legacy behind and ensuring that we leave this world a better place. And that's what I'd like to do, that one day, if I'm no more, but this world becomes a better place because I've created a product that people can use in generations to come.